Hi guys, where you, uh, visit, you join me as I visit uh, the lovely fishing village of Fiscado. Um, out that way is uh, the island of Lefkas, uh, where most of the boats go this time of year for shelter for the winter and of course as uh, people who do marine works and all that sort of stuff over there. Quite a big community yachts over there actually. So yeah, we're um, getting into uh, October now and uh, as you can see there's not an awful lot happening there. There's still a lot of yachts here. Quite a few live here I would think from uh, people I know. But still a very nice place. So there's a pre-earthquake building. Um, during the earthquake of 53 the island was hit quite badly in uh, this area uh, especially. So there's not many of those buildings left. So if you were to come in by yacht, that's the direction you come in, I suppose. Um, Ithaca in the distance. We just had one storm after another for the last week or so. Um, uh, Ithaca got hit quite badly. Uh, as did parts of Kefalonia, but uh, of course I live up on the mountain <laughs> at the back of uh, Augustoli, so it hasn't really bothered us. So yeah, that's the view you get as you come in by yacht. So I must have photographed this area a thousand times or more over the years <laughs> but it is beautiful um, if you drive down that that road there and follow it round you come to uh, Focky Beach um, which was uh, completely devastated by the Medicaine hurricane as I would prefer to call it um, the family that have got the taverna there lost everything. Um, but from, from what I've heard, I'm yet to visit. It, it uh, has all been rebuilt. Um, a friend of mine, uh, the Admiral Salmon Chinos, anchored up there a few weeks ago and says it's all been restored lovely and it's a nice little anchorage. So, um, so yeah, for your bearings, we've just come from that area there. That's the port of Fuscado. We're walking back now towards the car. There's um, some Roman burial ground, or apparently, or something, along those lines here. These are tombs down there, just recently unearthed over the last few years, and been working on that. Well, I was going to video the sign so that some of you could pause the video and read it, but yeah, pretty badly sun damaged. Has been a hot one this year, I have to say. Didn't have any rain from May right the way through to when I came out September apparently so yeah that sort of explains that really and for those of you into that sort of thing this is the other side of the road down he unearthed this a couple of years ago maybe I think they're still working with it um, Roman tombs People quite often say to me when they hear I come out this time of year and I'm going to be living here, um, oh, it'd be very quiet in the uh, winter. You won't like it. <laughs> What's not to like? <laughs> there's no hire cars, there's no people on the beaches. Yeah, all right, some of the tavernas are closed. Um, but that just means that some of my friends are available now to go for a drink with. So that's even better for me. Um, but where I am in Nagasoli, that's still open. Um, so yeah, it's uh, for me, it's the ideal time of year, it's not too hot, it's not cold, it gets a bit chilly at night but I've got a heater in the flat if I need it, I haven't had to put that on yet. Um, I've only just started wearing a shirt with sleeves in it. So yeah, so that's uh, the lovely little fishing village of Fascado. We're now round the back. I'm going to head off to uh, Assos and see uh, see how that's looking these days. 
um, because that, the last time I was out here, was under about three foot of uh, rubble mud and the army had to dig the road out to get to the people in the village. <laughs> Unbelievable. I'm told now it's, uh, you'd never know. So we'll go and have a look and we'll see because I'm sure a few of you will be interested in that. Um, and if you're wondering how I'm getting around, I'm, uh, I'm going to buy myself a motorcycle um, probably this week. But when people come to visit, I shall be uh, going to see my friend Tassos and Satoris for one of these. Uh, and, uh, and yeah, get a good deal. So, we're in the back of uh, Fuscado now. Um, we'll be heading out over in that direction there. The village is in the other direction. You just walk up that street there from the car park and you're in the middle of everything. So thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do. If you've tripped up against me and uh, wonder what I'm about, hit my videos and stroll down, scroll down them and uh, you'll see. It's just a vlog really of uh, things I get up to. So, catch you guys later. Thanks for watching.